You'll hear us talk a lot here at Squash Skills about putting bite and spin on your short ball. So using the racket face to come underneath the ball to put spin and revolutions on the ball so that when it hits the front wall or the side wall or the floor, it bites and grips and stays really low and really short. Now the interesting thing about the way Rami does it is that he does it from a very short swing on the backhand and actually has quite a long follow through. So we naturally teach coming from a slightly higher backswing and a shorter follow through but still getting that downward and underneath motion to put the revolutions on the ball. But here with Rami doing the shorter swing, the longer follow through, you can really see what he's doing when he's putting the revolutions on the ball and then the effect that it has on the ball when it hits the front wall and then catches the nick. Firstly with that cross court drop, you can see the racket head speed is generated, see how it flies into the nick very quickly. And then similarly on the, on the backhand side with the straight drop, once again comes right underneath the ball, fires the ball in, Marwan's given up on the shot, it's the end of the game, but you can see how quickly that ball gets to the nick and then dies.